the video will start in 8 cancel a student nurse allegedly told her mystery pain could be all in her head was left horrified after a scan revealed she was riddled with cancer Georgia McLennan realized the situation was very bad after the procedure uncovered tumors throughout her body, including in her lungs A seemingly healthy and vibrant 23-year-old, her exterior had masked the horrific, fast-growing disease which had spread across her insides Doctors feared she would not make it through the weekend. But after undergoing months of grueling chemotherapy and weekly spinal injections to treat her cancer, Georgia made a remarkable recovery. Now in remission, she has spoken out about her terrifying ordeal and the months of pain she endured leading up to her devastating diagnosis. When I saw the scan I realized this is very bad," the brave young woman, from the Gold Coast in Queensland, Australia, told the Gold Coast Bulletin They couldn't believe how healthy I looked given what they found inside me. Georgia, who lives in Broad Beach, spent three months going back and forth to the doctors after she began suffering from stabbing pains and aches At one point, she said she was also so bloated she looked pregnant. Desperate for an answer, she made the trip once or twice a week before one GP allegedly eventually asked her whether it might be all in her head. Another doctor prescribed stomach ulcer medication, but the student's pain continued, and she was sent for a scan last May, the newspaper reports. Shockingly, the PET scan showed her body was riddled with tumors. Speaking to Nine News, Georgia recalled of medics, they thought I was going to die before the result of the biopsy came back. She added, I knew it was really bad because it was so spread out. The young woman was diagnosed with a Burkitt's lymphoma, a fast growing form of non Hodgkin lymphoma, following the scan. She was told she had tumors on her spleen and liver, as well as in her lungs. But she said the only time she cried was when she had to tell her parents. I was just in shock, Georgia, now 24, told the news site. She subsequently underwent three months of daily chemotherapy while documenting her battle against the disease on her Instagram page. When photo on the site shows her smiling in hospital. She wrote alongside the image, Today I had a PICC line inserted, spinal injections and started day one of my new chemotherapy. I had the best day, even though it was a little bit scary. I'm so grateful to have such amazing friends and family and feel so lucky to receive my treatment, even though it makes me feel sick. Now Georgia is in remission and dreams of becoming an oncology nurse. Earlier today, she posted another beaming photo on Instagram, writing, I really do believe that when you're giving out positive energy, you get it back. The student has shared her story to raise awareness of the Gold Coast Hospital Foundation S Care for Cancer Lunch, which will raise money for its vital patient transport service and chemotherapy chairs.